What's popping guys? Today I have another video for you and today um, I have a cardboard weapon and it's called the M4 Benelli Super 90. It's a cool shotgun made from cardboard and paper, uh, PVA glue and just a little bit of masking tape just to hold it down. This part's working, you can push it back and forward. Um, this part is quite wobbly here, I don't know why, why I don't know why it's so wobbly. I think it's because this part, this is one reinforcement, it's come off, so probably that's why. Um, this is to stop it from coming all the way out. Um, I really wanted to make this. My first aim was to make a shot, a different type, but then I realised um, Magical Amazing made a cardboard one, but I didn't follow his tutorial. I just looked at his image of the garden and then I saw, wow, that looks quite cool. So then I thought, oh, why don't I make that one instead? Um, so yeah. The time it took just one hour to make. I know it doesn't look t too, too nice. I know it's not the best. I have other better ones, but... Yeah, I do have an M1911 I am showing you guys, but I will show you that right now. My M1911, just hold on. So here's the M1911 I made on cardboard. It doesn't have a working slide. Um, that. And then the trigger for this, the barrel, is covered in masking tape. The magazine. Yes. Slides right in. Sights. So yeah, who cares about that? Now on to the real gun I made. M4. This is what I really wanted to show you. The M4 Super 90 Benelli. So yeah, it's really cool. It's, it's just a fun little weapon to just run around with. <laughs> yeah. And it's like, mm, I just see this weapon every time. So I'm like, why not just make this and put it on YouTube? The handle is quite easy to make, just two layers of the handle and stick it on. The stock paper reinforced with cardboard and this part. I didn't make the part where it curves like that because it wouldn't stick on. I don't know why, the PVA glue wasn't too strong because I ran out with the sellotape. This sellotape is from uh, the previous weapons I made. Like just, I took some sellotape off the parts that I didn't really need. More sellotape, they just parts covered with sellotape. I don't know why, but yeah. Um, I really like this weapon, it has a pump, I think that's what it's called. These barrels, I didn't know how to stick these on at first, but then I found out a way just come on with PVA glue and just reinforce them with, with tape. How easy is that, right? No, it was not easy. See this, this has so much sellotape. This only has like five screws. This is like 20. Gotta be kidding me, man. Like I would take some sellotape off this and put it under, which I am gonna do right now. Yeah. <laughs> Sneaky. See, yeah, I just put it on. Yeah. Now it works even better. Now it's even stronger. Yeah, boy. I know, guys. It's, I don't know why I did that. Actually, there's loads of sellotape on here that I don't need. I can just 
stick it on all day and all day, day, day. Just you can do it forever and ever 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 and ever. Okay, maybe not that part. Never and ever and ever. Oh, and I'm taking off parts that I really do need. <laughs> so yeah. Okay, why am I doing this? Just why, guys? I don't know why I'm doing this, but yeah. I think I might have to end the video there because what am I doing? So yeah. So bye.